Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Step Campus. So in this video, we are going to talk about asset and expect uh, element on the text. Okay, how this asset and expect will apply on the text. Okay. Also, apart from the text, we are going to see uh, how it will be affect on an element as well. Okay. So here, text is also an element, but yeah, we will see some other aspect as well for this one. So let's get started, guys. So for this one, I will go to the command prompt first. Okay. And from this command prompt, you know how to go to our Visual Studio. So uh, we have to write code V, and then we will code space uh, dot, then we will come to our command prompt. Okay. Now what we have to do now? Now uh, in this test folder, I am going to create one fold one file. Okay, and then I will give it assert underscore expect underscore text because we are going to see on a text okay the operation of asset and expect on a text okay now don't forget to give dot js because the night watch is javascript based uh, uh, automation tool so we have to write a code in a javascript okay so this time i want to write a code from the scratch so i will copy the code from the previous lecture okay just go to my previous lecture read all the from the starting one lecture and then you will be quite confident about this code okay now what we have to do yep uh, so let's delete these things okay just save it okay for this time i am just changing the test suit name assert underscore expect underscore text this is our suit name white suit i am talking because in javascript or nightwatch if you say every test case is considered as a suit go to the tab command prompt and run it okay for running these things uh we required one code this is the code we have to get npx night watch test then inside test we have to write asset underscore expert text dot js okay and then we have to give this one just run it okay so it will open yeah so in this website we are going to do our operations okay now let's start the first one so we have to check whether the text is present or not using asset and expert both okay so let's just start the guys so for checking a text percent or not uh, we have to write like browser okay browser dot okay so what we are checking we are checking that text is percent or not na so browser dot assert okay dot contains text so just go with that syntax okay you will get to know about this one just go to the copy the css selector know how to select this one just go to inspect part okay just click this one click here and just copy the css selector from there okay copy copy selector go to our code again just paste the copy selector here okay and then pass here the text so this text should be present okay so i am copying this text copy this one go there and paste there okay and give some pause browser dot pause give it 2 seconds okay save it go to command prompt run it okay what we are doing we are just going to assert like the con the text should present there okay this text uh, there Uh, present there. Okay, we have given uh, some error. Okay, so this should be browser dot pause. We have given comma. That's why we are getting that error. No problem. We will fix it quickly, and then save it and run it again. Okay, just be careful when you are going to write the syntax. Okay, it's a human error. That's not an issue. Yeah. So we are checking like this text should present. Okay. Yeah. So we can see. Okay, we have to go to the command prompt. Yeah, we can see this one is passed. Okay, so this is present. Okay, just see the negative quickly. Just copy this one, paste there. Should not contain. Okay, just checking a neg negative scenario. Okay, so it it will fail this time because it, we already check it is present. Now we are using a negative in uh, assertion that is not present. So this time the second scenario will be failed. Okay, first will be pass, second will be failed. Let's see quickly. Okay, okay, okay. It will taking time, but not an issue. Yes, we can see this will give an error. Why is error? So we can see the uh, error log also. It's saying like what we have written. We have written like it does not contain this one, but we are getting. Okay, you know why we are getting because we already checked here. Okay, 
so if you want to pass this one just give it verifying or some other text okay because we are getting verify now we are checking like we are getting verifying or not so definitely this won't be correct that's why it will pass okay because it's a negative scenario okay it is running mm -mm -mm -mm. yeah it will check the script okay and both will be passed both the session will be passed this time yes okay now we will quickly move to the expect one okay do you you got this thing right so let make it comment go to the expect one just writing here checking with expect okay okay go there go down c k i n g okay checking with expect okay so let's say so we have to check whether the particular text is present or not okay here we are just checking the text is present or not but here we are checking like particular text would only present so for this one like we have to write browser dot okay uh, we are using now expect okay so we have to write like expect dot element this is a syntax okay you can uh, see my previous lecture you will be get to know about this thing dot to dot b it's a very easy syntax okay what we are we are writing like a normal english like browser dot expect element what element so this element this element okay we already seen this element okay to be equal to be equal of which one to be equal of this one so this is the we are writing the same thing but in a different context okay same thing in a different context okay just to save it just give some pause as well so that we can see that thing and then save it okay like just see the syntax what we are saying now we are saying like just check this element and this should be equal to this one okay this is very small english syntax we are using in the night watch okay same both are same but here we are checking this should be present only okay quickly we will see the negative also in this only okay we will see that one later okay just just see here just pasting here and to not be equal to not be equal this time it should fail because uh, here we are getting but if we are getting, we, if you give the same thing with not one so it will fail right just save it go to the command prompt run it so at this time one will be pass and one will be fail okay see so we can see here so to be equal also getting failed ah, okay 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 browser dot expect element and this one there to be equal please consider the doctor ah, okay we have given expect element running expect element command okay let's see the uh, code first uh, here we can't see it see the code what code is saying dot element we have given okay and we have given the css selector as well and then we are using aha uh -huh not to be equal it should be text to be equal okay text to equal sorry i have given mistakenly text to equal okay we are checking this text to equal and here we are checking text not text not to equal okay just save it go to command and run it okay we have to write text there okay that is the error from our end but not an issue uh when we practice two to three times then it will be good we will get to know about these things okay the syntax error okay first assertion pass second assertion should fail okay yeah second assertion should fail first one is passed okay second assertion should fail okay mm, where we can see yeah we can see here so one is passed okay and another is fail okay another you know why it is fail okay so to pass it just make not equal verifying again so this should this text we are not getting and we will verify this thing okay so this time both the uh, test cases should be passed let's see first one is passed you can see here tick also okay when you get the tick like this one so you can see like it is passing now okay good now here we will see some important thing see now i don't want to write this whole text suppose this text will be very long now so i don't want to write the, that lengthy lengthy text okay so how can i reduce this one just copy this one okay paste there and just make it uh, remove the equal and type contain okay remove this one and type contain and don't give the full text just give assert only 
okay i'm just giving a set only okay just pause this two so that uh, time will take more and then we will see the concept directly yeah so this time what we are doing now we are just telling the night watch like i want to check the text is percent or not but with the don't with this full name will full name okay we are just passing the asset only so you can say there uh, it is passed okay i hope you are clear now we will see some other expected values go to the browser now see here uh, we have some important uh, and instant, interesting thing also see okay first i will show you these things okay just see these things clearly so there is one button that is remove list so you can see here one potato and two tom two potato okay so there are uh, list okay two list when i click on this remove list now so you can see like that potato and uh, potato text are gone okay so we will verify that element okay just refresh it now it will come back and then again again we click on this one it, it gone again okay so we will verify these things so control shift i for the inspect one go to this one click here okay again click there okay yes uh, we have to copy this one copy copy selector okay go to the text now what we are uh, checking we are checking the element so element how we will check so we will right click this okay so expect this will present or not present okay so browser okay i will comment this out okay browser browser dot okay assert assert dot element or uh, not capital okay just to check element percent okay so this is a syntax for checking element is percent or not okay so we will give the css selector here uh, copy not copy pause just copy and paste the pause here okay go to the command and run it what we are telling now we are just checking the element is percent or not so we will get the for the first time when we open so we have this list percent okay yes you can see it, it is passed just go to that website again okay we will inspect this button just right click this one copy and copy selector go to the command uh, editor again and we have to click the button browser dot click it's a simple syntax okay now we have clicked this one now what we have to do we have to check for this element okay now we have to check for this element before this i will give some pause okay why i will give pause so that we can see the steps very clearly okay if you don't get pause then it will open and close directly now this will this time it will pass it will pass but okay let me comment it okay this time it will fail because of this condition because we have removed the list because of removed list okay save it go to the command run it okay now we are checking the element is percent or not percent okay so first assertion will pass and then second assertion will fail okay we are getting one potato one tomato okay both are potato not fine and second time it will fail and our message will be correct yeah now it is failing okay so you are getting like what we are getting okay and here we will select not present not dot element present okay go there run it again okay not uh, okay i have given the wrong syntax okay just see first i will tell you what is the syntax error there mm let it run uh, it will run first but second it will fail again because we have some issue okay this time it is passed okay no problem so either we will write not dot element or we can directly write not element plus uh, not dot element plus. yeah correct uh, we have given the right one no problem i thought like a dot i have i uh, didn't mention there okay that's why i'm worrying okay so you will get to know about this one okay now we will see from the expect okay just pause this one okay just comment out okay now we will see the same same example but with the expect okay so expect element is present or not okay so browser browser dot expect okay dot element dot element okay then here we have to give the css so copy this one paste here 
ओके एंड देन वी हैव टू चेक प्रेजेंट ऑन डेट टू बी प्रेजेंट ओके वेरी सिमिलर सी यू कैन सी एयर टेक्स टू बी इक्वल टेस्ट टू इक्वल टू बी प्रेजेंट ओके इट्स अ वेरी इंग्लिश लाइक वी कैन से इज अ सिंपल इंग्लिश ओके एंड टू बी प्रेजेंट वाट टू बी प्रेजेंट ओके सो एज ऑफ नाउ लाइक वी आर नॉट चेकिंग वाट टू बी प्रेजेंट सो जस्ट मेक इट लाइक दिट वे ओनली टू बी प्रेजेंट ओके दिस टाइम वी आर जस्ट चेकिंग दिस प्रेजेंट ऑन नॉट एंड गिव सम पॉज वी आर गिविंग पॉज डॉट पॉज ऑफ लेट मेक टू सेकेंड ओके just save it and go to there come on for run it okay so we are checking whether the element is present or not okay okay so you can see it's passed okay it means element is present so like this way we can take the element as well uh, not present also you know just copy these things okay click here and make it uh, to uh, see uh, expect element to To be not also we can write. To be not also we can write. To not be also we can write. So anything we can write. Okay, just save it and run it again. So this time it will fail. Okay, because because we are checking that should not present, but it was present. Okay, it is present, and it will clear this one. Yes. Okay. Why na? See, we know this is present. Okay, we know this is present. but we are giving the negative scenario we are giving the negative not present so it will fail okay if we want to make pass of this one then again we have to click this list okay we have to click this list so that the below one will be also passed save it go there okay what we are doing now to make it pass we are just removing this list so we are clicking on the remove list okay very easy not an issue you will go to this video again if you not get for the first time okay then you will get to know about all the things yeah you can see the two assertion has been passed now so in this video that's it guys so we will uh, discuss uh, other elements in the next video so till now good night and happy learning